Welcome to Andy's Brick Builds, and today we're going over the Disney Amusement Park. This is the last time we'll be going over this because this will be taken down and something else will be coming into its place. So I'm very excited to share that with you guys. Stay tuned for that in a future video. But before we go on into the amusement park, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Turn on notifications button on if you have not already. And we'll be starting off here where we had the Disney train and station. Looks really nice right here. Of course, have the Disney train parked right up front. And then right here, we do have Main Street USA. Looks really nice. And besides that, we do have some Main Street buildings here and here. And then we do have the Parade Float 4 Plus set coming down here. Connected by this 1x2 dark gray tile is this string with Tinkerbell on it. Get that her into focus. And then it goes all the way up here where the same iteration is putting a plate over it. it is being used for Disney Castle. Peter Pan, Peter Pan and Wendy's Flight Over London is over here. It looks really nice and I do like how it flows nicely with the Main Street buildings. We have a little green area right here. Then we do have the up house sitting right beside the mini Haunted Mansion. Then we have the little parade float part of the Disney Train 4 Plus set. And then over here we do have Wayne the Pooh's um, Lego Idea set. And then right here we have the mini Disney Castle. So glad I was able to put that in this kind of like green space going around over here. Over here we do have the Avengers Quinjet in the Avengers area. I really didn't finish, but... It's all right. And then we over here, we do have the Lego Disney 100 Anniversary Pro and that came out in July. Looks really nice. And over here, we do have um, the Disney Wish Custom model that I have made. Also looks really nice. Then of course, the 2016 Disney Castle in all its glory. Looks just amazing. And then over here, we do have some Disney 100 minifigures which looks really nice besides some other Disney models and custom models of my own creation. Over here, we do have this little red silo kind of painted with American flag color. So 13 bricks tall, it has the American blue over here, then the red white transitioning up to the top, where I do kind of have a crow's nest with the older Captain America up there. And probably one of my favorite parts of this music park is the go-kart track. We do have the new Lego go-kart. Check out my, my review on those. Those are really cool. And then we do have other go-karts scattered around which are custom and others that are from the official Lego versions. And over here, we do have this really nice iteration of mine on Big Thunder Mountain, which I do like. It looks really nice. Didn't really finish it. You can see there's some parts of sitting over here, but all in all, Looks really nice. I had a lot of fun experimenting with different kind of rock details. So that was a lot of learning, which I'm really happy I did do. And then over here, we do have the 2023 Mini Steamboat Willy promo. Over here, we do have kind of like the autumn tree. I have some autumn parts, so I made an autumn tree. Then over here, we do have the um, 1928 kind of brick for the Disney... Um, for the Steamboat Willie, which is down there. I wanted to add that to something over here and that looked like the perfect thing. So I really do hope you guys did enjoy this last update on the amusement park. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Turn notifications button on if you have not already. And I can't wait to tell you guys when I take this all apart, what is going to be coming here because it is going to be really cool and a huge Lego room update will be coming in the next month or so. So I can't wait to share it out with you guys. See you guys in the next video. Have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.